What time of year is the best for pouring concrete? <laughs> it's going to come down to temperature when you're talking about when is the optimum time of year to pour concrete. Of course, depending on where you're located geographically as well. What you want to avoid is any of the extreme temperatures. You don't want anything too cold and certainly not freezing, but you also don't want it too hot. That's also very important. Concrete re relies on hydration and consistent temperature in order to work properly and achieve a consistently strong finish strength. If you pour concrete when the temperatures drop below 10 degrees Celsius, it really slows down the set time of the concrete and you definitely have to be concerned about any freezing weather because if you freeze fresh green concrete, you almost certainly are going to ruin it. You'll have moisture that is absorbed into the surface layer and then it will freeze and expand and just explode and spall the entire surface layer of your concrete and that's definitely not what you want. Similarly, if it's too hot and you pour concrete, the heat is going to evaporate all of the water from the surface and the concrete needs that water. If you let it dry out prematurely, the concrete is going to be very weak and then it's going to shrink when it loses that water. I mean, it's going to shrink anyway because it's definitely going to lose that water eventually, but ideally we want it to be strong first and that's why you don't want your concrete to dry out when it's really early or freshly placed. If it's hot as heck outside and you're placing and finishing concrete, you have to take extensive steps to provide shade, cover it with plastic, do something to protect this concrete from evaporating and losing all of that water it needs for the proper hydration. If you had to pour in really hot weather, then what you would want to do is start very, very early in the morning. You've probably noticed that some concrete crews are out there 4 a.m., 5 a.m., and they're doing this to get out and beat the heat of the day. Get that concrete placed, finished, and already setting up before the heat of the day is really on it. And that's something that you can try to do. You know, if you're trying to figure out what the best time of year is, maybe it's more like what's the best time of day to pour the concrete. As long as it's not freezing overnight, or you're not trying to pour in 40 degree heat, then you probably are going to be okay. Start early if you're dealing with hot weather, or start late if you're dealing with cold weather. You start early with hot weather so that the concrete has a chance to stiffen up and set up before the heat of the day is on it. In cold weather, you pour late in the day with an accelerant inside of the mix. And throughout the night, the accelerant is going to be causing the concrete to set up extra fast. Part of that process means it's going to be creating more heat than normal. If you pour concrete late at night and apply something like burlap or dome it with plastic, it generates its own heat. I mean, you could use heated blankets with which to cure that concrete in cold weather. That's commonly used for cold weather construction. Or you can rely on the accelerant and the exothermic reaction of the concrete hardening to create its own heat source to protect it from the freezing weather overnight. And by the time the second night rolls around, that concrete's already hard enough that it can probably withstand some of those colder temperatures. So what time of year is best to pour concrete? I mean, just avoid the extreme temperatures and you'll probably have success.